I'm Emma Saperstein. I am the Harold J. Miosi Art Gallery Coordinator at Cuesta College. Um, I'm here to talk to you today about our inverse summer residency that will be taking place virtually this year. What we do is we work with between 15 and 20 students. Um, it's application based, so you apply to be a part of the program. And we have a rotating cast of performance artists who come and work with you specifically to create a performance of your own that shows downtown San Luis Obispo. So this year the residents will be, will be running from July 20th to August 7th. Um, we'll still be working with visiting artists, thinkers, performance artists, lecturers from outside the area who will be working with the residents in the virtual space and, and we're, we'll culminate uh, in an exhibition on August 7th. Um, that residents will participate in. Obviously, we'll have to be, be flexible in terms of what that looks like um, and creative and innovative and, and how that looks like in the virtual space. So we'll work individually with each student um, to, de to determine the best, the best way forward. If you're a painter or a sculptor, like I define myself as like a metal worker or a sculptor, and it has married my object making in like new ways that I couldn't have thought fathomable. Uh, so something that I learned from the residency was not to just be like inside of myself, but to collaborate with other artists. Before my work or like my drawings, you know, I would just kind of always be working alone. And being in that group setting kind of forced me to make connections I normally wouldn't make. For me, it was really good just like getting to know other artists and, and having the opportunity to sort of see outside of your own little box and see where you need to be pushed and how to push yourself and have a platform to do that. Creating those lasting artistic relationships helps the longevity of my career and uh, it also like, pushes my work goals. I think people should do it because even if they've never performed before, it could be something that they fall in love with, a new artistic revenue, um, and that's what it was for me. So I'm gonna reapply and I encourage everyone to apply. The Inverse Residency Program is an application-based process. The application is very simple. The application includes uh, your name, your website if you have it, uh, examples of your work, and a short bio, um, and why you're interested in participating in the program. I hope that you can apply and please reach out if you have any questions.